that guy has got the warm-up perfectly sorted lying asleep with his number on under a lovely little tree that, that's confidence that, that is confidence that's there's our winner right there right well done guys Yo, how are you doing? Oh, you're doing you five? Yeah, yeah. What's happening, my little peppers? It's Wednesday night, and thanks to a last minute tip off from Alan and Harriet, we find ourselves at the spectacular Croft Race Track. For a super special 10k, they actually run around the track itself, which is very, very exciting. Now, I have very fond memories of coming here when I was a little one with my dad and brothers to watch things like the British Touring Cars, the golden age of. Alan Menu and Jason Plato absolutely thrashing it in the Renault Laguna. Rickard Rydell in the estate Volvo. He looked like Jonathan Creek on NOS. Now, it's rather lovely to also know that my dad did the exact same thing with his dad back when he was a little lad. And very, very impressively, he actually went on to win the Group B finals of the Supermoto bikes, that is, in the late 80s, 90s, something like that. Oh, here we go, might be the winner. One knee. One. Well done, mate. Keep pushing. Well done, mate. Well done, Crook. That was a 5k finishing that started at 7. Well done, mate. We go at quarter to eight. Woo. All right, Smith. So, what's your link to Croft? Uh, oh. I mean, I don't want to start on a dark note, but uh, I think the first time I came, I may have seen the death. Um, I, didn't, I didn't mean that. I meant when you, I meant when you did a tractor. Oh! Uh, yeah, tractor. What did you drive? I drove, <laughs> I think the first car was like a Honda Accord, just to get used to this track. <laughs> get it. A while. Money well spent. And then... Uh, <laughs> that was a Groupon, right? That was a Groupon deal <laughs> you got there. Well done. Well done. <laughs> I've been told that after giving in all the big dog behaviour at the uh, Great North 10K, Smith's gonna <laughs> slow down and enjoy this one with me. Thanks for time. How very kind of you, Smith. How very kind. We're looking to improve your time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fed Smith to be my coach, even though I did do a half marathon yesterday. <laughs> Oh, told you my training's all over the place. That's what makes it exciting. Yeah, this looks like a good, 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 uh, good track, good surface. Yeah? yeah. Oh, you look quite atmospheric in that low sun, Smith. Love it. <laughs> well done. Well done. Woo! Good luck, lads. <laughs> woo, woo, woo. Yeah. Good luck, guys, on the track. <laughs> Good luck, Smith. Good luck, everyone. <laughs> Me and Smith jostling there for position. <laughs> I'm getting carried away. I'm getting carried away. Social media Influences guru. In the <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. How cool is this for a Wednesday evening? I usually say how much I enjoy running on closed roads for the novelty of it. Whereas I think tonight takes the crown for running on a closed racetrack. It is very, very fun indeed. Look at this. Thanks guys. Now, we're just over a mile in to have some lovely straight sections. However, it's pretty windy out here with it being so exposed. So I've kept filming to a minimum. Hopefully, we'll have a tailwind shortly as we head back towards the grandstand. So there's two options and maybe a junior run. There's the 5K, which is one and a half laps of the track, and the 10K, which is three laps of the track. We're probably two thirds of the way through that one. I'm going canny. Going canny. Canny. Canny, not too bad. Northern now, Smith. I'm a Geordie now. Mock Geordie. Biker Grove's coming back, so I've heard.
remember to use those distance markers to get your braking right oh. speed. Could have braked at 50. I'm gonna plow in. Sam the anchor's on right at the end. Yeah, full send. Thanks, guys. Yay, thank you. Woo. Didn't have the camera on in time, but thank you. Just the boost I needed. Found. Yo, well done. I'm making it look fast, right? <laughs> I'm all right, thanks, mate. Thanks for your help, though. All right, we're lapping about a third of the way there. And we're on for a sub 52, oh, yeah. 10K, we are here. However, the field here is absolutely red hot. Darton Harriers host the race, and there is a lot of club colours. As there always are with these really cool events, and particularly with this one being a real PB course, you can see, because people have turned up tonight. Well done, mate. Is that so amazing? Well done, mate. Here's that big black straight. Ooh, it's windy, but it's magnificent as it stretches away in the distance. Now, unfortunately, I don't have the rights. However, if it would enhance your viewing pleasure, feel free to hum along in your head to the chain by Fleetwood Mac or Jessica by the Almond Brothers Band. Da -da 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 -da. Da, 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 da. So you get I can't breathe. Well done, mate. Go on. Is that first place, mate? I think so. Yeah. Well done, mate. Go on. Make it look easy. All right. So we're coming in to the end of lap two. How you doing? Cheers, guys. Oh. Cheers, man. So I'm coming in to the end of lap two and starting to feed it. I can really feel yesterday's half marathon at this point. Woo! Cheers. I think top 10. I'm top 10, I think. Take on some fuel. Yeah. Don't blame you. Thank you. Appreciate that. I've got a bit of a stitch now. Just under here. Oh, but maybe two, three kit to go. We'll grind it out. It's worth it. It's always worth it. Woo. Well done, mate. Thank you. Keep going. Too, Look at that low sun. Gorgeous. I always find there's something quite mesmerizing about it. It almost draws you in. About a kilometer to go, I think. Woo. Yay! Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Hey, thank you. Oh, cheers, guys. Oh, cheers, mate. Thank you very much. Nice. And then spin. Nice. Darlo Harriers Athletics Club. Pit Probably. stop. Nice. Well done, mate. Woo! Well done, Swell Dale. Well done, mate. It's worth noting that we met last year, right? Yeah. At the Gateshead 10K. We both did all right. Did yeah. Did. And he pulled me along, dragged me along. Thank you very much. And since then, you've gone from good to bloody brilliant. No, I, I can't swear. Far. To very, very brilliant. Watching a Strava is like watching Olympian rise. Whereas I am like a pudding. So well done. Well Thank done. you, mate. Cheers. Success story for Strava. A beast. Yeah, my name's Barry, a member of Downton Harriers. And this has been Pit Stop Festival. Hope yeah. everyone's had fun. Get in. Cheers, man. So that's a wrap on what was a very wonderful Wednesday. A couple of laps around memory lane for me, which was extra special. So thanks again to Alan and Harry for the tip off. So did you enjoy that? Very good. And that's gotta be one ticked off the running bucket list, doesn't it? Run round a closed race track. The touring cars have been there. I think the British Superbikes have been there at some point. I'll say it again, my dad won the Group B finals for Supermoto back in about 1876. There's a lot of history around this track and it's very cool to say that, you know, we're part of it now. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Our footsteps are a tiny little memory. That's some rubber. That's exactly, some rubber on that exactly. A tiny little memory on this esteemed circuit. So until next time, cheers as always, mate. Thank you for being my wingman, looking All after right. me, staying with me. And I know you could run an awful lot faster. It really does mean a lot. So until next time, that's a wrap. Oh yeah, and I should have said this before, but thank you to Dan. <laughs>
<laughs> what? What a bloke, eh? What a bloke. I want to say thank you, Dan Harry, is for putting the race on to all the marshals, volunteers, spectators, and runners for making it such a great evening. And to everyone who subscribed recently, thank you. It means a lot. Okay, until next time. That's a wrap.